Maalaga talaga siya, totoo yun. And, um, parang yung trato pag may tanda eh, lahat. Yun yung hindi ko makakalimutan nung, hindi ko naman sinasadyang mag-observe, pero yun yung napapansin ko. At talagang, um, sobrang approachable siya sa lahat ng tao, kahit sa sobrang dami ng tao sa self, um, kahit, alam mo yun, pagod na pagod na siya, kasi siya yung maate, siya yung nagdidirect. So talagang, Um, yun ang hindi ko makakalimutan na kahit maraming humihida sa kanya doon, talagang um, composed siya at ready lagi na, you know, makipag-usap sa mga tao. So, yun ang makakalimutan. And, yung mga scenes namin together, sobrang, <laughs> sobrang natural lang niya. Kaya nga, parang, iba kasi yung style niya eh. Kaya, ini-enjoy ko nung, um, nung ginagawa namin. Kasi, Parang pag nagbabatuhan kami ng linya, parang na siyang totoong buhay kasi <laughs> wala kasi wala kami masyadong sinusundan na kung ano yung mga gagawin namin. Kaya yun yung masarap kasi nga sinasabi niya, uh, nagsimula siya sa indie. Ako din, hindi yung ginagawa ko nung nagsimula ako bilang artista. So, ang sarap lang ng feeling na sa ganitong klaseng proyekto, nag nagagawa din namin yun. At siya pa yung ka-eksena ko. So, yun. Yun talaga for me, hindi ko makakalimutan. So excited na ako sa mga susunod na gagawin namin kasi so far yung mga, yung mga excited na ginagawa namin is yung mga kulitan pa lang eh. So excited na ako na mag-level up na mag-level up kasi ang layo pa ng mapupuntahan ng characters namin together. Sobrang excited ako. Alright, thank, thank you, so you DJ Ryan. Maraming you. salamat. Ito, medyo exciting itong next na magtatanong. All the way also from Toronto, Canada. Toronto? Coco Martini. Ang name niya. Serioso. Yes. Nakakalasing siguro yan. Coco Martini! Serioso pa parang joke. Ayun. Pari na pailaw mo. Eh, siya parin yun eh. Hello. Hello. Good morning po dyan sa Pilipinas at uh, ay, ako yung pala, balik ka sa Toronto. <laughs> Ayan na. Uh, Go ahead, shoot your uh, question. Congratulations po, direct po ako, uh, idol. At uh, hi, lobby po, congratulations, uh, Ma'am Charo. Ang uh, question po po kay direct po ako. Uh, sa karakter na tanggol, para din may ito sa karakter na baldor doon sa unang bata kaya po? Uh, sobra siya magkaiba. Kasi sabi ko nga, may mga inspiration kami doon sa pelikula na ginawa niyo at PJ. Pero ibang iba yung karakter ko. Lahat actually. Wala akong, walang similar doon sa ano. Kahit yung pangalan iba eh. From Baldo to Tanggol. Kasi nga, um, alam kasi namin na ano eh, kung dahil teleserye to, um, nilawakan namin talaga yung kwento at yung lalim ng bawat ka. Yun. Alright. Thank you, Idol. Thank you, Idol. Naka-t-shirt pa siya nung ano. Nasa oh, rin. Wow. Full outfit talaga. Thank you, Papa Martini, all the way from Toronto, Canada. Thank you, MJ. Alright, next. Uh, from United Arab Emirates naman, Expat Media. Let's call it Kalila De Camo. Hi, Kalila. Kalila. Kalila, are you there? I think she is. Hi. Hi. Um, I just want to congratulate Kalila for being for my question, this is addressed to Miss Lovipo. Which scenes in this 2023 Bata Kiyako remind you of your father at PJ? And which scenes do you think would have made him particularly proud of you? Yes, Lovipo. Yung GBC, nakakandong dadang. Yeah, yun. So, um, so far, yun siguro. Kasi nga, um, yun, napaka-cute at saka natural na nung eksena na yun. Ganun nga sila yung kulitan. Yun. Siguro kasi, yun, yun, isa sa mga bagay na hindi ko pa masyadong nagagawa yung ganitong kasing character. Parang yun nga din sabi ni Coco sa akin before, na parang, um, 
iibahin natin kasi the usual characters that I play are very like serious and ano um, ano bang mga description like a bit too sensual or what you know and so for me um feel ko mga proud si Papa na ganito ang classic character naman yung ko for Jake ko kaya nagpapasalamat ako na kahit pa paano na break ko din yung usual na ginagawa ko at hindi lang basta basta pa classic na proyekto kundi dito pa sa FDJs ang bata Okay, thank you. And Jay, before, okay, you're good na, no? Kasi Kalila, ay, thank you. Kalila. Maraming salamat. Uh, thank you. And Jay, gusto kong tanong kasi, uh, si Ma'am Charo, I have a question. Kasi gusto kong malinig from her. She had a napaka-rich na 30 years TV experience. Uh, Ma'am Charo, the stories. You've been an executive of this beautiful family for more than what? 30 years din, Alice, di Ma'am Charo, um, Paano po dumating sa inyo itong offer na to ng, to be part of this? Uh, kasi alam ko picky kayo when it comes to accepting. I know! Even yung, huwag doon na-enjoy nyo yung Ramona character na, ah, tapos na! How did uh, the offer come about dito sa FPJ's Battle Cat? I got a call from Coco. He was filming. Pero sa loob pala talaga ng tawag. Yes, he was in San Francisco. San Francisco, uh, right? Uh, in LA filming for the Metro Manila Film uh -huh. Festival. So, inuwagan niya ako and then he offered me a role in Parang Kiyapo. And right away, I said yes. And he kind of gave me a description of the character. Pero, agad nandun yung trust ko sa kanya bilang isang um, creator of the content. No? Kasi nakasama ako sa probinsyano. And just like my Short lang yung stint ko, guest lang ako. Ayaw nga, ano na parang tapos na ako. Three days nga lang. Eh alam mo naman, charmer ito. Hindi ka makahindi. Yung three days ko naging seven days. So extend pa yung lagay na yun? Na-extend pa yung lagay na yun? Na-extend yun, oo. So, tuwa-tuwa naman ako, pero bitin. Di ba? Bitin yung experience. Kasi yung energy sa set ni Coco talagang very contagious eh. Nakikita mo talaga yung passion niya, yung commitment sa trabaho, tapos very single-minded in what he wants for the program. And kilalang kilala niya yung mga characters niya. Hindi ko nga alam kung paano niya ginagawa. Yung multitasking, di ba siya ang nagbibigay ng linya, siya ang nagbablock ng mga artista, tapos siya ang naglalagay ng, even the camera blocking, di ba? Nihirap mo na. I mean, he is such a gifted person. Wow. Oh, oh. And mahirap yan. But na na champion niya nyan. Oh, oh. And I wish ko po. I mean, all the good things that everyone shared about you. Totoo, totoo po yon. And I really just wish many, many more blessings. You know, for you that much more success, good health. Huwag kang bibigay sa dami ng ginagawa mo. Oo, mag-iingat ka. At, you know, I wish a world full of many more Coco Martins. Wow, big! That's big. Yeah. Thank you. You stay kind-hearted. Oh, stay, stay generous. And always be grounded. Ah, yan ang importante. Been there, done that ako eh. I know! Oh, okay, more than oh. three decades of ano, di ba? Yeah. So, the importante, importante talaga is you stay grounded because in this world, lahat lumilipas. And congratulations from Charles on the Sunod ng Awards. So, uh, happy for you. Okay, MJ, go ahead. So Alright, last uh, four. Last oh, four? Kasi siyempre nag-stay sila sa Zoom eh. Oh. Kailangan pagbigyan natin sila. Of All the way from Dubai, Johnny Biryani. Hi Johnny from Tag 91.1. Hi MJ. Hi. Hi MJ. I have a question for for ako, um, Mangshara and uh, Kayla Vigno. Possibly, possibly, pa maging guest to mga dating uh, cast uh, about a part to the Kiapo movie dito sa Bata Kiapo teleserye. And if you have a personal favorite na mga guest na artist dito sa show, I think Koho can answer that. Actually, napakalaking posible. Kasi nga, sabi namin, ngayon pa lang, <laughs> nasalisimulan ko naman to, yung bilang kukulkwento, kung nakasetwa yung story, is yung mga pista. 
Ngayon pa lang nung binilang namin kung ilan na yung mga artist lang namin doon, nasa 52 na. Kaya, hindi imposible na mag-guest ko yung mga uh, original cast na ano, ng Batang Kapo. And excited kami. And then, personally, ako rin papasalamat ako sa kanila. At at uh, dapat lang talaga na maging part sila ng show nito. Yeah. Alright. Thank you! Johnny, maraming salamat. Thank you, thank you so much. Alright. Balik tayo sa Japan from uh, the Filipino Japanese Journal in Japan, si Dan Corpus. Hi, Dan. Dan? Are you there? Okay, balik natin si Dan. Let's move to Pia Piquero, all the way from Expat Media United Arab Emirates. Hi, Pia. Hello. Hi, go ahead. Good evening, everyone. I am Pia Piquero of Expat Media UAE. This question is for the directors, Direct Malu and Direct Oak. Coming from the super successful run of Amber Beach Channel, it is undeniable that the whole show was a success since MPJ's Amber Beach Channel became the longest running drama series of Philippine television. Are you confident that Batan Kiapo proposed to be another major success and why? Yes. That's <laughs> sad! <laughs> <laughs> I think we'd like to get into that mindset right so that things will come out more beautiful and we can we can uh, work towards creating a better show for the audience and then and, and, and for some of it. Okay. mindset yeah yes Actually, kung uh, sa mga nakapanood kayo nina, nung pin-premier uh, namin kayo nina, day one pa lang, makikita mo na yung difference. Sabi ko nga, first time ko sa lahat ng mga teleserye ko na uh, sa unang episode sa Monday, isang oras. Kadalasan kasi di ba mga 18 minutes to 22 minutes lang yan. Eh. Ito, isang oras na dire-direcho, full of action lahat. Saka sinigurado namin yung quality talaga. Na, talagang sinagad namin, nag-create namin in terms of uh, camera works, uh, lahat music, uh, may mga poly, lahat. Talagang ang sarap niyang panoorin, ang sarap niyang experience na talagang parang nararamdaman natin na gusto talaga na natin ano, lumaban at sumabay sa paggawa ng, um, ng mga teleserye sa ibang bansa. Kaya sobrang kami proud at ako ngayon pa lang sinasabi ko, First time to magyaya bang, alam ko na magiging successful to project. Thank you, Pia. Maraming salamat. Down to our last two questions, pero kung may tanong mo na ako. Pia. I'm sure. Kailan ako. Anyone from this table? Ano, nabis, nakita ko kasi sa set, si Coco, intuitive director. Minsan, on the spot. Diba? Yung lines, minsan, doon na binubuo. How did that work for all of you? Kasi nakausap ko si Tita Susan Africa, na-challenge daw siya. It was a breath of fresh air para sa kanya. Para sa inyo. Si Mr. Irma siguro can share. Kasi ang dami na nilang, ano eh, pinagsamahan, di ba? Nakita mo ba kung kano? Na-mention na kanina. Right, right. Yes, yes, yes. yes. At, okay. <laughs> Actually, I'm a, I'm a bit scared, okay? Sa approach na gano'n? Oo, uh -oh, I'm a bit scared because I am always, um, I prepare, I, okay. I craft, I, <laughs> I need to know, I need to know. But I'm accepting the challenge <laughs> and I want to see what I can do with this new approach that he's doing. Because I'm afraid that okay, so I'm going to ask ah, what's going on? Ah, what's going on? How's it going on? Ah, okay. Ah, okay. Okay, sige. Okay. Ganun. I need the information to be able to... Ah, kasi... Well, anyway, okay. As an actor, uh, television talaga is not our medium because everything is fast. Right. So everything we have to deliver. Okay? It's not our medium. Otherwise, kasi 
So, hindi ako mababaliw ako. Mababaliw. It, 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 yun, 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 yun. So, kailangan, I have the preparation, I have the background, I have my past to be able to get to where I want to go. Right. So, so, <laughs> dahil nandito kami, and this is a work in progress, as they say. It's a work in progress, which is actually nice because these are pleasant surprises that actually will challenge us as actually, actors right. to be able to create, to be able to give, and to be able to give justice to what is being asked from us. So talagang, I'm looking forward to be directed by... I am, I am looking forward to be directed by Coco. Of course, direct Malu, I worked with several times. Alam ko na yung ano, but Coco, I haven't worked as a director. Nice so, so first, <laughs> this is my first, and I am looking forward to it, and I accept your challenge. Challenge accepted. Good job. Di ba nakapagpagpagpagpagpagpagpagpagpagpagpagpagpagpagpagpagpagpagpagpagpagpagpagpagpagpagpagpagpagpagpagpagpagpagpagpagpagpagpagpagpagpagpagpagpagpagpagpag
yun lang. That's why I asked it there. Parang ang ganda pala, ang breath of fresh air yung moment na yun. Yung approach na yun. Kuya Bo, you wanna add? Oo oh, oh, naman. We have to hear from the, the John. I know. Uh, we, we just have to try that. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I'm like, uh, yeah, uh, I like improv. Improvisation, right? I like doing that. So if that's the case, that's challenge the case. accepted. Challenge accepted. Let's do that. Come, <laughs> Charo. You wanna say? Oh, uh, yeah. I mean, there has to be a change of mindset because. I'm so interested to hear this. Honestly, I'm not sure that I'm going to be able to do it. I'm not sure that I'm going to be able to do it. But I'm not sure that I'm going to be able to do it. I'm not sure that I'm going to be able to do it. I'm not sure that I'm going to be able to do it. I'm not sure that I'm going to be able to do it. I'm not sure that kasi bakit? Sabi ko, ganun ako magtiwala sa kanila. Yung hinahayaan ko, bubuhay ko lang, ito lang yung guide ko. Gusto ko, bilang artista, ikaw magtatrabaho kung paano mong bubuhay nila. Pero ako, as a director, alam ko yung vision ko. Right. Collaboration. Right. Diba? Ito yung nasa isip ko, gusto ko ikaw mag-surprise sa akin. Surprising mo ako paano mo siya bubuhay. Yun yung, yun yung nakikita ko. Like, kunyari sa eksena, kung bakit ito lang buhay kang binibigay, like, ang sinasabi ko, gusto ko, ikaw mag-isip. Pag sinabi ko kasi yung lahat yung denumero, gusto ko dito kalitin mo, ganyan, ganyan, technical na yun. Hindi ko, ang ina-achieve ko kasi yung organic eh. Ang ina-achieve ko yung totoo. Yung para bang kahit malayo yung shot ko, parang totoo, nag-away ba talaga sila? Yung ganun, hindi yung alam ko na, na, ba, na napaka-choreography na alam ko na uh, sukat na sukat, ganyan. Kasi ako wala akong pakialam kahit sa blocking eh. Kahit magkasapawan kayo, kahit magkano kayo. Basta gusto ko, nararamdaman ko yung eksena. Kasi alam ko, yun yung tumatagos sa mga manonood. Tumatagos yun sa television ko sa pelikula. Yun yung style ko. Napanood namin yung kanya. Oh my God.